Well, greetings everybody. Joseph Green Mountain Gold Trap out on another venture. And still, of course, company. Got Christopher still from Michigan. His son is down there, Tavian, with my, well, promotional agent, great guy, knows a lot about promoting and uh, gold equipment. He's with us today. He came down from up north in Burlington and he brought a gift to me. Well, a couple of gifts actually. Some of you might have seen this in uh, Vogus showed it in one of his videos with the plaster tool. It's a magnetic probe and it's really, really good for finding, you know, your 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 dropouts of, of your heavies, your, your magnetic sands. And we've been digging for a while and I just said to Christopher, I haven't even started shooting video yet. But he just probed over in here where he's moving rocks right now. Go ahead and stick that down in there. Found some really, really coarse, coarse black sand. Take a look at that. I couldn't even get that in there. It was on top of a rock. Take a look at that. So he's like, I'm moving. <laughs> <laughs> so, and it's as simple as shaking it in there. And stuff generally comes right off, but it's not doing it now, Christopher. I noticed if you've got to have it towards the surface, you put it under the water, it wants that, uh, you want to come up towards the surface with the tip of it. <laughs> That's too coarse. It just wants to stay on there. <laughs> Go figure. It's been working fine. But let's take a walk down here and say hi to John. These rocks are super slippery, y'all. Ah. Having a good time, John? I'm having a time of my life today. I couldn't be any place better. It's awesome. <laughs> yeah. And this is the three foot riverbed hog that he got. Some of my YouTube followers did watch his video, Dark Canyon Prospecting. That's John. He came to my house, I don't know, was it in the fall or? It was, uh, well, actually, beginning of winter. Beginning of winter time, because it snowed on him when I came. Right, right. He came down and did an interview in the shop and picked up the three foot riverbed hog. And today's actually the first time he's had it out. That's right. Yep. Great material. A lot of heavies, a lot of black sands where I'm digging. We panned out underneath this big boulder here behind me. And the first pan, I got a couple of small specks of gold. One of them going so small, I was impressed. I was like, okay, this is how it works. Yeah. Right, here we go. So, uh, the black sands magnetic probe is telling me there's so many heavies right here. I'm staying right where I'm at because I know I got a little bit of gold. And I know the heavies are here, and it's great easy digging out. I mean, some of these bigger balls, there's plenty of material around here. There's hundreds of big rocks, so it's packed in there tight. It's nice. Oh, yeah. All right. Have fun. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we're going to keep on going, folks. We'll let you know how it goes. side of that rock which comes up like this and all over in there and Christopher has been digging all through here we've taken it down quite a ways John did a clean out that Canyon prospecting he had some pretty good gold in his did some video footage y'all have to go to his channel once he gets it published and check that out he's got some really good footage of the uh, feeding the gold trap. Those phones are just amazing with slow motion. I can't do that as good with this camera as you all know, but someday I'll upgrade, but I've got other priorities. 
Christopher keeps begging me to do a <laughs> do a clean out and I'm like no patience let's just keep digging so that's what we're gonna do catch in a while we're still at it I'm getting ready to leave fairly soon so Christopher he's like okay if we're gonna be leaving soon I gotta go over and try some of those cracks over there so he's across the river and Tavian and John are still down there. Looks like they're getting ready to do a clean out. I see the bucket on top of the skid plate. And we've dug this even further. Pulled out some big rocks. I mean, this was all this was all filled with material. And we've moved it all. So pretty soon, we'll be doing a clean out. Today's probably going to be, you know, obviously a short video, but that's okay. I know some of you know myself. I I don't uh, I don't mind longer videos if I've got time to watch them, but shorter videos are good too. So we'll catch you in a bit. And there goes John across the test. <laughs> awesome. Don't go for a swim, John. <laughs> We're having a great time, folks. Gold is just the bonus. All right, so the guys are back from the other side. Christopher got a good bunch of material he's gonna take care of. I am going to do a clean out. And I don't really have any place to set up the tripod, so I'll just do it and show you what I get at the end. Back in a bit. So I'd say we all had a good time. <laughs> and I know I did, I always do. So, got some chunky stuff today. That black sand that was in that gold trap today was so coarse, it wanted to ride right out of the pan. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. And that probe tool that placer tool probe tool right there on the rock that works really good keeps you on the line we dug a deep hole John and Tavian work together down there and Christopher and I work together up here teamwork so that's the gold for the day all right y'all Thank you all for coming along and enjoying this Vermont scenery. Nice Vermont mountain stream. Don't forget to like, share, and leave a comment and subscribe. We'll catch you all later, folks. We got to hike out of here.